In today's edition of the Ultimate Apex Legends 1v1 Guide, we're looking at two of the top tier legends in the entire game. Both legends are masters of movement and are highly selected in the competitive scene. Octane vs Wraith This matchup is sure to incite some debate, as Octane and Wraith are two of the most popular legends in the entire game. Wraith has been around since the inception of Apex Legends and was instantly a fan favorite. Her versatility, her movement abilities, and her ability to help her teammates as well make her a very well-balanced and highly played champion. Octane is quite possibly the most fun legend to play with in all of Apex Legends as he is in fact the king of speed and movement. Let's start with Wraith. Wraith's passive is very helpful in the Battle Royale game mode as it provides her audio cues when there's impending danger. This passive is extremely useful in the Battle Royale, however it wouldn't be as strong in a 1v1 situation. Usually in a 1v1, you're pretty much aware of where your enemy is at most times. Wraith's tactical ability is one of the strongest abilities in the entire game. Being invulnerable and getting a speed boost for a short duration allows her to reposition or evade danger very effectively. The tactical wouldn't be as strong in a 1v1, it would still be very good, however the chemtrail that's left behind showing exactly where Wraith is headed is a disadvantage in a 1v1 because there's no outside sources to distract where she's headed. Wraith's ultimate ability is also again one of the strongest moves in the entire game, as it provides free rotation for her teammates to get from one position to another very safely. This is extremely valuable in the battle royale, especially in endgame situations. Unfortunately, again, however, the ultimate wouldn't be as strong in a 1v1 because there's no teammates that you need to help reposition. It would still be useful because you do get a speed increase while in the ultimate, and getting both portals down can allow you to play with them and have a little bit of trickery against your opponent. All in all, Wraith is quite possibly the strongest legend in the entire game. Her skill set is extremely useful in the battle royale and would be for the most part very useful in a 1v1 as well. We're going to give Wraith a grade of A in a 1v1 situation. Let's take a look at Octane. Octane again is quite possibly the most fun legend to play in all of Apex Legends. Apex Legends is a game based around movement and speed, and Octane is in fact the king of speed and movement. Although Octane's tactical ability does self-inflict some damage, the speed boost that he gets from it makes it more than worth it. Increasing your speed as much as Octane's tactical does gives him a huge advantage in terms of rotation, repositioning, evading danger, and so much more. Paired with his passive that allows him to heal back up over time after he has not received any damage gives Octane a huge advantage to be able to evade danger, heal up, and re-engage a fight. Plus, Octane's jump pads provide him with yet another tool for repositioning, rotation, and evading danger. Yes, the enemies can use the jump pads as well, but with Octane's speed boost, he should be able to reposition and use the jump pads more effectively than anyone else. Octane's entire kit is not only useful for the Battle Royale game mode, but it would be extremely useful in a 1v1 situation as well. We're going to give Octane a grade of S, making him and Gibraltar the only S-tier legends that we've graded for a 1v1 thus far. So, who would win? Octane vs Wraith At the end of the day, I think Octane would take this matchup 5-4. It would be an absolute barn burner and a ton of fun to watch, but Octane's entire kit is useful in a 1v1 situation and the BR, whereas Wraith more so excels in the BR. She's still very good for a 1v1, but she's not as strong as Octane would be. What do you guys think? Who would win? Who do you want to see next on the Ultimate Apex Legends 1v1 Guide?